Hey, what's going on everyone? In this quick video, I'm going to show you how you can watch the UK-based version of Netflix from anywhere in the world. And also in this video, guys, I'll be walking you through the British-based version of Netflix, including TV shows and movies. And I'll even play a little bit in real time, just so you guys can see that this method is actually working. Let's get started. Okay, guys, so as you can see, I'm over here on my Netflix account and I'm actually located outside of the United Kingdom. So this means I miss out on hundreds of TV shows and movies that can only be found on the UK um, based version of the platform. And some of these titles include Rick and Morty, um, Friends, and a long list of British um, TV shows as well. So one of the best ways on how you can fix this is actually by using a VPN. And essentially what a VPN does is it changes your current location and replaces it with a new one with a new IP address. So you're easily able to bypass any kind of geo-restricted content that you may not be able to find in your particular uh, location. So the VPN I'm going to be using for this video is one called uh, NordVPN. I've been using uh, this specific provider for around seven months now, and I have found it to be one of the best and most reliable at allowing myself to kind of watch all the different versions of Netflix, including the UK, America, India, Spanish, um, the Spanish version, and heaps of others as well. So if you are looking to get started with NordVPN and follow along in this video, I do have a massive 70% discount link down below in the video description. So now that I have NordVPN open, it's super simple to get started. All I have to do is search for the United Kingdom. So I'll search for that one and now we have the UK. And if I wanna go ahead and connect to an individual server, I also have that control as well by clicking on these three dots. So I'll click on that one and just say for example, I want to connect to a particular server. Um, I can just click on one of these and I'll click on that one. And this will just take a couple of moments to connect. And once this is highlighted in the green, which we can see there, um, this just notifies me that my entire computer, including all of my browsers, is, is now connected. And I can also go ahead and follow that same process on my iPhone and Android device as well. So now that's done, I'll go back to my Netflix homepage. I'll refresh the browser. And this is an essential step as this will actually load us onto the UK-based version of the platform. So now that I'm here, guys, I'll go to TV shows and I'll just show you some of the kind of um, titles that are available on the UK based version of Netflix. So if I go to genres, we have an additional kind of category here, um, category categorized as British. Um, so if I click on this one, this will give me a huge list of British TV shows um, such as Peaky Blinders, The Thick of It, Hinterland, um, Sherlock, um, The IT Crowd. And if I keep scrolling down, I've got Luther, All Seasons of Top Gear, and the list pretty much um, keeps going on, guys. So if you're a huge kind of British um, crime TV show buff like myself, um, then this is absolute gold to kind of binge watch all of these great TV shows that can only be found on this version of uh, Netflix. And while I'm also here, I'll show you some of the um, movies that can also be found on the UK-based version of Netflix. So if I go to movies... I'll also go to genres as well. And I again have the British um, genre and also some additional ones as well. Um, but for this video, I'll click on this one. And if I scroll down, as you can see guys, we've got some great, um, some great UK movies um, such as The Darkest Hour, Dunkirk, um, Kingsman, um, Snatch, and heaps of others as well. We've got Louis Theroux, which is a TV show. Um, but as you can see guys, as I keep scrolling down, um, this pretty much just keeps uncovering um, new content. So what I'm going to do now is actually go ahead and play a really small snippet of one of these movies in real time when connected to the UK based version of Netflix just to show you guys that this method is actually working and also to share with you kind of some real world indications of what it's like as far as speed is concerned for actually using a VPN. So I'll just go ahead and click on this one. And again guys, I'll let this play out in real time with no edits whatsoever. And from my typical experience with connecting to the UK based version of Netflix, it typically does take around 10 seconds to get started. And as you can see guys, this is now working um, with no issues whatsoever.
So there you have it guys, that's a really quick and simple way on how you can watch the UK based version of Netflix from anywhere in the world. And again, if you are looking to get started with NordVPN, then don't forget to check out the massive discount link down below in the video description. So hopefully this video was helpful for you guys. Um, if you have any questions about VPNs or accessing the different versions of Netflix, then feel free to comment down below and I'll be more than happy uh, to help you guys out. So as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the next one.